What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general general collective reading, catch through side to everybody in between. Don't forget the uh, basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general reading. Um, I was going to tell you guys, I have been, I didn't get a spiritual download to do it. I just felt in, intuitively guided to do it, um, to make my, um, readings pre-recorded. So, uh, from now, from now on for a while, I might go live, um, down the line, but right now they're pre-recorded. Most of them will be pre-recorded and I'm going to upload them right after, but I'm just letting everybody know. Um, so no live for a while. It's just my very, very, very strong intuitive um logic reason and reasoning intuition to go pre-recording so just to let everybody know um just saying just saying if you like to donate is high priestess profile the links in the description box below paypal only no cash up no venmo um it's a very private confidential way to donate i do not publicly display your name or how much you donate if you donate through my private paypal for privacy and confidentiality purposes um i appreciate all the donations single mama two kids just saying Okay, so the channel message I received was um, someone has been trying very, very, very hard to hack into your personal information to steal from you again. Heard again. Um, but I heard this time it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Somebody knows their game now and they're about to um, communicate it to very important people very soon. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. That's some sick, shicey shit. Just saying. Um, so somebody has, um, apparently they've stole from you in the past and they've been hacking in. I've been getting a lot of cyber theft, cyber crime energy in here. Today's daily tea was that. Um, and I've gotten it in the past, but I'm getting it again tonight through another download. Um, so hacking, cyber theft, cyber crimes. I heard they've been trying very, very hard to get your personal information. Very, very, very secure. And a series of chain of events recently has made it more secure. Okay, I heard very, very, very secure. And a series of chain of events recently has made it, has made it more secure. So your personal information, if this resonates for you, it has been hacked in the past. Um, but, and it sounds like whoever these cyber thieves, cyber criminals are, they have physically stolen money from you in the past through means of um, hacking. So like hacking, cyber crimes, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. We have focus on the bottom of the deck. They were very focused on stealing your money, basically. Stealing your money, stealing your personal information. Greedy, 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 narcissistic energy here, uh, whoever this is for. Um, but um, I heard a series of chain of events recently um, has made it has made it secure but series of chain of events recently has made it more secure and i heard somebody uh, knows this person's game so they know they have stole from you in the past and um they're about to relay it to someone very very important soon so it sounds like somebody's on onto them we have focused again somebody's on to them um it is about to blow their cover in a huge way it is about to blow their cover in a huge way. So whoever this person is, you could be the person that knows this information on this cyber thief, cyber criminal, et cetera, et cetera, that's about to relay it to the person that has been stole from and you know this information, or you could be the person that's been stole from. Um, however that plugs in your life, there's millions and billions of people in the world. You have to plug yourself in the story, how you fit, if you do. If you don't, don't force it, just saying. But um but someone's been stole from through means of cyber theft, cyber criminal activity, sneakily getting someone's information. I'm thinking social number, green card number, name, date of birth, password information, that kind of thing. But you know, if this resonates for you, I feel you can either be the person um, that's about to relay it to a very high position, high important person, whoever you are. Position of high authority is what I'm feeling, but you plug it in how it resonates. Or you can be the person that was stole from. How that resonates, but um, um, somebody's on to this person. Somebody's definitely on to them. I think you are the person that's about to relay the information. Whoever you are. Spirit messages you have reflected. Peace. Beginnings on the bottom of the deck. 
Number two could be a very significant number as well as number 28. That could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to. 28 could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Two or 28 could be possible date of birth numbers, possible social numbers, possible green card numbers, possible lottery numbers, um, possible jersey numbers, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, or reoccurring numbers you're seeing out on advertisements or billboards, two or 28. New beginnings coming here. One of these cyber thieves, masculine energy is about to be fired soon. They are going to be shot. Whoa, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, this is strong. So I heard one of these thieves, um, cyber criminals that stole from you in the past, or a person that's about to relay the information that knows all this information that a person has been stole from, Maybe you're connected. I think you're connected to the cyber thief, but obviously you don't agree with their cyber criminal activity ways, and I don't blame you. So you plug it in how it resonates. But um, I heard the cyber one of the cyber thieves. So there's two plus for whoever this has been sold from. It sounds like a coven or a game or a cult or something like that that's been stealing from a person. But it sounds like they've been manipulating people in a community to gain the information in um, some shape form or fashion to hack in is um what i'm feeling um is what i'm feeling i didn't hear that that's just what i'm feeling um but people are on to them i think you're on to them at least one person is it might be two plus people in the universe somebody's on to them and they're about to relay it uh, and it's going to be very 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 um helpful and effective Okay, I heard it's going to be very, very helpful and effective. Um, so I think you, person that's about to help out the stolen person from the hacking and the identity theft and the cyber criminal activities, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, I heard it's going to be very effective, you relaying this information to the important person or people. I heard person, but you plug it in how it resonates. Kudos to you. Kudos to you. Kudos, just saying. Um, because we need more people like that in the universe. Um and I'm serious. I heard the person, one of the cyber um, thieves, criminals, is about to be terminated soon. For I'm assuming for theft, identity theft. Um, or when their ass gets charged, if they do get charged, which I hope to God they do. Um, just saying, just saying. Um, I, you know, they should be. Beginnings. New beginnings all across the board. Happy beginnings for some, very, very, very tearful beginnings for others because they are about to be charged, indicted. Whoo, we, this is strong. Okay, we have indictment energy in here. So new beginnings all across the board. So 555 five, five energy all across the board. Um, some are going to have new happy beginnings. So I think it's the person that got stole from is about to have a new happy beginning and the person that's about to relay this to the uh, important person. I think you're about to have a new happy beginning too because it's probably going to take stress, anxiety, worry, fear off you because you know this information is what I'm presuming. Because if I was in this, I'm not this person, but if I was this person, it would give me, it would take the stress, anxiety, worry, fear off me if I knew all this information is what I'm saying. So I think new happy beginnings for you too, because you get to offload the information and it makes you feel better is what I'm presuming. New happy beginnings for the person that's been stole from, but I heard tearful beginnings for the people or person or people that um, has stole cyber criminals, cyber thieves, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. One of them is going to be terminated um, and at least one's going to be charged and indicted, indicted. So indictment is basically, I uh, had to Google it a few months ago. Indictment is basically, criminal charges brought against um, criminals, like high-level criminals, high-level criminals, high-level charges, basically. It's not, um, like I said, um, you out being, you know, public intoxication and an officer writes you up for public intoxication. It's not a minor speeding ticket. It's not like a disturbing the peace kind of thing. It's serious, serious, like, crimes. Um, in this case, white-collar crimes. I'm just saying, just saying. Um, so new beginnings, 555 five, five energy, um, some very happy beginnings uh, for the ones that deserve it, it sounds like, some tearful, 
I'm thinking the new beginnings for the ones that are about to be indicted and terminated for the cyber thief, cyber criminal, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, activity. Um, her charges and indictments, I'm thinking jail and then prison is what I'm thinking. I didn't specifically hear that, but that's what I'm thinking. We have peace. Let me see if I hear anything with that. This is going to create balance in a community, finally. Putting away criminals that deserve it. Wow. Okay, I heard this is going to create balance in a community, finally putting away criminals that deserve it. This is strong. Um, this is so strong. So you plug it in how it resonates. So I heard it's going to create balance in a community. So it could be a physical community or an online community, but I'm feeling it's a physical community because of cyber crimes. And I mean, somebody physically got stole from uh, by means of cyber theft. Um, so I'm thinking a physical community, but you plug it in how it resonates, but I heard it's going to create balance in a community. So I'm thinking it's giving people like nine of swords energy, stress, anxiety, worry, fear, especially this person up here, because they know this information, but they, they don't want to be an accessory to a crime and I don't blame them, but they're about to offload the information. And it's, I think it's going to relieve their stress, anxiety, worry, fear, whoever you are and kudos to you. Um, I don't blame you. I wouldn't want to have to harbor that kind of information in. That That is terrible. Terrible. Who in the crap would want to harbor that kind of information in? I have no idea. That I couldn't live with myself trying to, having to harbor that kind of information in. I'm serious. I just, I couldn't. But that's just, that's not my nature. It's just not me. I'm a very open book kind of person. Um, so I, I couldn't live with myself kind of harboring that kind of information. Um, but everybody's different. But anyways, um, so kudos to you. But um, heard it's going to create balance in a community. So I think many people knew about this. I think it probably possibly could go Secret 7, and I didn't hear that in here, but it possibly could. But you plug in your life however it resonates. If that resonates for you, I was going to pull a Kipper card. Um, I didn't hear jail or prison, but I am feeling jail or prison energy, and I'm just being serious about this. Spirit messages you have requested. Community? Yeah. Oh, my God. Occupation on the bottom of the deck. Number 34 could be a very significant number in your life. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible date of birth number. Possible lottery number. Possible jersey number. Possible green card number. Etc. 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 Number 34. It could be reoccurrent numbers you're seeing out of advertisements or billboards. Number 34. Someone seriously lied about someone's occupation in the past in a huge way. Some, the cyber, cyber thieves, secret cyber thieves. Some, someone's professional occupation. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Oh, Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. So I think in the cyber thieves lied. And I didn't specifically hear that, that it was them that lied, but... Somebody lied on somebody's occupation, a professional occupation. I'm thinking it was the cyber thieves, but I think it's the reason they lied about it. So I'm thinking the cyber thieves lied about somebody's professional occupation. Um, I, and the cyber thieves have lied that they're really, they're behind the scenes cyber thieves. So I think they have, um, they obviously have careers out in the 3D community that cover up their cyber thiefy activity. Um, they most certainly do. And one of them is a very, very high position, high authority. It, it is, it, they, their uh, occupation is about to tank into the ground. Okay, I heard they most certainly do. And one of them is a high position, high authority. And um, I think they're the one about to be terminated. Um, but my point is, okay, so there's two situations in here. One, hiding of occupation, which are the cyber thieves that really have nice, careers out in the 3D to hide, cover up their criminal TV, cyber TV activity behind the scenes. At least one of them because they're about to be terminated. Now, there's two plus, so you have to plug in your situation and how it resonates. The other situation is, I think you, person that was stole from, I heard they lied on your occupation. I think it's you they lied on. Um, 
they lied and said, um, they lied on your occupation in the past. So they might have slandered you and said you did something in your occupation when you didn't, or maybe they said you were a certain occupation when you wasn't, um, like some kind of criminal occupation when you wasn't, or you wasn't the right credentials and you were, however that resonates. Um, but they lied, they intentionally lied. People are about to figure this out in a huge way. Okay, I heard they intentionally lied and people are about to figure this out in a huge way. So. They intentionally lied on your occupation, the person that was stole from is what I'm feeling. But I heard people are about to figure that out in a huge way. Maybe they were saying um, that they didn't intentionally lie or they're trying to play it off like they didn't really know and they were just saying whatever. But you can, you know, you shouldn't say just say whatever. Uh, and that's just the truth because it can always turn around and bite you in the ass. Um, I e the situation, but they're doing way more behind the, obviously way more behind the scenes, like stealing from you, person that got stole from, um, and they lied and slandered on your occupation. I mean, how low the low of the low can you go? And I'm just serious about that. So number 39 can be very significant as well. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, number 39. It could be um, significant reoccurring numbers you're seeing out in the universe on bill billboards or advertisements, number 39, community. The community is about to stand up in a huge, huge, huge way. Won't justice. Oh my Lord, wow, this is strong. So I heard the community is about to stand up in a huge, huge, huge way. They want justice. I'm gonna pull one more. Spirit messages you have to purchase. So the community is about to stand up in a huge, huge, huge way. I heard they want justice. So justice for the person that was stole from through cyber crime, cyber activities, etc., etc., etc. But it, in all fairness, it doesn't sound like it just affected the person that was stole from. It sounds like it affected many people. It affected many, many, many people. Many. Won't justice to be served. Okay, okay, okay. So that's confirmation from a spiritual realm. Thank you, spirit. So I heard it affected many people. So not just the person that was stole from, it affected many, many, many people. Um, and I heard they want justice. They want justice for these cyber crime, cyber criminal people, cyber thievers. And I and I don't I don't blame them. I mean, this is terrible. Number 19 could be a um, very significant number in your life in some shape or profession. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible date of birth number, possible lottery number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, um, possible reoccurring number you're seeing out on billboards or advertisements, number 19, coffin. A huge cycle has already ended. It's revealing a ton of truth. Lots of action is about to be had very, very, very soon. Okay, I heard a huge cycle has already ended um, and it's revealed a lot, a lot of truth very quickly. So I think the cyber criminal or criminals has been stopped finally. Um, I think it's been a slow going process. It has definitely been a slow going process because of so many lies in the past, but it has finally ended. Oh, okay. I heard it's been a slow going process in the past because of so many lies, but it has finally ended. So I think they tried to slow it down because they knew they were getting money uh, from you, person that was stole from, um, just saying. Um, but I heard it's finally ended. So it's finally ended. Um, thank God. Um, but they were manipulating the crap out of the community. You could be a community member in here. You, I, Whoever is about to reveal this to an important person that's going to be very effective, I think you are definitely a community member, for sure, for sure, for sure. Um, a community member of the person that was stole from. Um, I think you're a member of their community in some shape, form, or fashion. Now, whatever community that is, it could be online, it could be a workplace situation, it could be a physical community. Um, it could be a family member, it could be a neighbor, but you are a member of this person's community, I'm feeling, in some shape, form, or fashion, whether it's online, whether it's workplace, whether it's neighbor, whether it's family, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You're a member of their community in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and you're a member of this person's community in some shape, form, or fashion, the person you're about to reveal, important person you're about to reveal the information to because you communicate with them in some shape, form, or fashion, or you're about to. Um, so a lot of community energy in here, you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, but I heard, um, 
that it was slow going to end the process finally, but it is finally ended. So cycle completed, 10, 10, 10, 10 energy, 10 cycle completion energy. Coffin in this situation is cycle finally completed, but I heard since the cycle has been completed, so the cycle's already been completed, um, that so much truth has been revealed very quickly. Um, and I think it's giving you a huge wake up call, person that's about to reveal this information to the important person. Um, since this cycle has completed, this coffin death cycle completion energy here, this is not a physical death in this situation. This is um, cycle completion of the cyber death energy. Um, that's exactly what I'm feeling. Um, and cycle completion of a community that's been manipulated so horribly to steal from this person or people. I feel it's one person, it might be several people. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. It's like dual energy here is what I'm feeling. Um, but this is not physical death in this situation. It's cycle completion energy. But I heard since it has completed, so much information has been revealed and so quickly. And people, basically the community has had a huge wake up call since the cycle, final cycle completion and all this huge information has been revealed. I think in a positive way, not in a privacy breach of confidentiality and privacy breach kind of way, in a positive way, in a very positive way. Okay, I heard it in a very positive way. Okay, so the information has been revealed in a very positive way to the community. So not a breach of security, breach of privacy, breach of confidentiality kind of way, in a positive way. Um, and I think that's what's going to prompt you, person of the community, that to because you haven't revealed it yet to the person, important person, but you're about to, if that, if that makes sense, um, because of cycle completion and all this information that's come out in a very positive, non-privacy breaching, non-confidentiality um, breaching kind of way, if that makes sense, um, if that makes sense. For some, you could be dealing with Scorpio because uh, death energy is, um, Scorpionic energy. If you are, they could have Scorpio in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Venus, Jupiter, or you could be a Scorpio um, revealing this information. I'm feeling you could either be a Scorpio revealing this information, or you could be a Scorpio that is stole and you're a cyber criminal. However, that resonates. Or you could be a Scorpio that was stole from. However, that resonates. I feel it could go any of those ways, but you plug it in how it resonates. So the Scorpionic energy heavy in here for sure. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. This is about to become a very, 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 very huge thing. Very. Very quickly. Oh, lower. I heard this is about to become a very, very, very huge thing very quickly. So this whole privacy, confidentiality, breach, um, cyber thieving um, situation, I heard it's about to become a very, very, very huge thing quickly. So you plug it in how it resonates. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. I hope everybody has a wonderful, fantastical night. Namaste.